uh, start of you, Elliot. Actually, I was going. I mean, it's, there's such a huge um, fan base already in place for this for this kind of series for this franchise. Is that it? Must be so great knowing that there's this kind of passionate audience already in place. But does it add a kind of pressure of sorts, kind of knowing that a lot of the fans already have ideas of who these characters are and what they mean to them? I think it's added pressure since we sh- we filmed actually, because I, I think I was in a way quite lucky because I wasn't really aware that there was such a big fan base uh, until quite late on, I kind of naively strolled in. Um, But yes, I was very nervous for it to come out, but I've been, there's a flip side of it, which is that everybody, if they like something, which it looks like they do, um, is so warm and and welcoming. And um, yeah, I've just had, we've had such a lovely reception. It's been great. Yeah, they're precious. I mean, I don't often get the chance to ask people after the show is out because traditionally junkets are kind of an advance. But today I can speak to you with the knowledge and say that this is the number one show on Netflix. I mean, how amazing is that? Is it still quite overwhelming and surreal? Yeah, it is. It's really it's really overwhelming because you can't see all the people who have watched the show. So you like it's hard to like. I don't know, I guess. Yeah, I, I feel like it's hard to visualize all these people watching the show and enjoying the show. And um, yeah, it's been it's been really it's been really nice. Um, and also, we can't go anywhere, so we can't actually see people's responses unless we're uh, online or on our phones and stuff. So yeah, it's just been a mix of emotions, I think. And, and Elliot, going back to the the auditioning process, I imagine for something like this, it must be quite rigorous. And do you remember how you how where you were and how you felt when you found out you had the part? Um, it, um, genuinely no, because I um because it was I didn't do very many auditions, but it was such a long time between because uh, we were sort of penciled first, and then there was this big wait, so it felt like an ongoing conversation. I think I was um I think I was at the Edinburgh Fringe. Um, which now seems so long ago um, when I found out um, that I got the part and it was just sort of it all happened very quickly and and I think my mind jumped straight to the logistics of like okay so I've got to be an island for a really long time and it wasn't really until I got got on the set that it hit me that we were doing a Netflix show and I was in it I think it I, I had a really delayed reaction and I was going to impress you, you obviously said that it's obviously it's hard to know people's reactions because we're not sort of out there at the moment because obviously everyone's sort of stuck indoors. But with that in mind, did you have any kind of plans to watch it when it launched last Friday? Were there any family Zooms or anything to kind of mark the occasion? I mean, yeah, like there were so many things I wanted to do. Like at one point I even wanted to like, because I work in a cinema, like an independent cinema, and I really wanted to ask to have a screening and then get all the cast and, and oh, like our families so cool. involved um which would have been great and we couldn't we obviously couldn't do that um so it was just yeah it's just me and my my family like my my younger sisters but they're fans of the cartoon so they were they were really really excited to watch it which is great you can do the cinema thing for series two, I reckon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to, I mean, of course, the fans want to know about who's playing their, these characters they know so dearly. So I was going to ask you some quick fire questions uh, to just get a sense of some of the your fellow cast members. So I was going to start, um, I'll start with you, Precious. Who was the biggest joker on set? Who was the biggest joker? Okay, so it's a toss up between Elliot and Alicia. Elliot is very witty, like you're super witty. Um and yeah, you just you just know how to make people laugh, which I love. And Alicia is really silly. And so she's always up for like doing like <laughs> random things. She also says like random things as if they're facts, which I find quite funny. Um, <laughs> like she would say like odd things <laughs> as if they're facts, um, which is quite funny. So I'd say it's a toss up between them two. Oh, by the way, Precious, uh, they, I think Abigail and Danny both said that you were the best best dressed, just to let you know, just passing on that <gasps> information. <All right. gasps> Lovely. And 1,000% agree. Yeah. Um, so, um, considering, I'm, I'm sure there was a big rap party, Elio, I was going to ask, who is the best and worst dancer amongst the crew, cast and crew? <laughs> oh, no. I don't know if I can... Precious knows. I don't know if I can reveal that. It feels mean. I, um, I think... <laughs> Everyone was a really great dancer, and um, and some some dance in their in their own way. Um, but I hope that one day um, the public will get to see and decide for themselves because I'm not I'm not revealing that. It's okay. very funny if I do go. Precious, who would you say is the most likely to actually have secret magical powers? 
Oh, who's the most likely to have secret magical powers? Um, I reckon Elliot. I feel like everyone else would. Yeah, I feel like everyone else would would say if they had it. <laughs> like I know Hannah for a fact. If she had secret, like oh secret God, magical yeah. powers, we'd all know about these powers. <laughs> I, I feel like you you'd keep it. Yeah, you'd keep that. Cool. Close to your chest. Thank you. Brilliant. Well, thank you so much for your time today, guys, and best of luck with the, the series and if you shoot series two. And I'll I'll tell Liv you said hello as well, Elliot. <laughs> I'm go I'm gonna text her the moment you go. Um oh. and I'm sorry I couldn't answer your dance question. I, I really panicked. I didn't want to throw anyone under the bus. That's okay. <laughs> 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 yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey you guys, huh? Hey you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey you guys!